Welcome to the admission policy for MBA program at IIT Jodhpur. They offer two programs, MBA and MBA technology. Selection criteria is the same. There might be a bit of eligibility difference between the two programs. You can just take a look at that. I have focused more on the MBA program for this one. Let's take the look at the three step process. First is that you will have to register on your own. Second is you will be shortlisted for PI. The PI is going to happen only in virtual mode for this. And finally, you will get a final merit list. The very first thing is registration for which you will have to apply to the IIT Jodhpur website, which is this itj.ac.in slash schools. Then uh, last date is 31st January. In fact, for all the IITs, last date is 31st January for all the recent IITs that, that we are discussing. So if you meet the eligibility criteria, just, just be very quick, fill it. Fee details are 1200 rupees for the general OBC and EWS candidates and half of it for SCST and PWD. How they are going to give you the PI shortlist? I've just mentioned GDPI shortlist. It's only the PI in this case. Minimum academic eligibility is that you should have any undergraduate degree with 60% if you are from general EWS or OBC background. Otherwise, 55% uh, for SCST and PWD. If you have CGPA, then it is 6 and 5.5 respectively for the two types of categories. You should definitely have a valid CAD 2024 score, which is important. And finally, how they are going to decide on uh, your shortlist? There are three aspects to it. One is the CAT overall scaled score, then work experience and gender diversity. When I talk about CAT overall scaled score, they have not given any details. They have just said that, you know, we can apply these cutoffs. We can also think about applying the sectional cutoffs, but all these things will be decided according to how many people apply and, you know, what they decide later on. But one thing is for sure that if you have a good CAT percentile, then there's a good chance that you will get a call from um, IIT Jodhpur. Similarly, for work experience, they have again not said what type of uh, score they are going to assign for whatever work experience, but they have definitely said that work experience gained in coaching centers will not be considered. So even if it was a full time work experience, along with that <coughs> small scale business also, they are not considering like retail stores, NGOs, petrol pumps, etc. So if you have that, you know, sorry for work experience. 15 days or less will be counted as one month, 15 days or more will be counted as one month and 15 days or less will be not counted as part of your work experience. And the cutoff date is the day of the application for MBA admission when it goes live. So you can consider January. Gender diversity again, it is not given, but of course it is expected that for males it should be zero, but for non-males it should be some score, but they have not given the score. For international applicants, Every single thing will be the same as the domestic applicants. But whether your graduation is equivalent to the India's graduation, you can check that on this uh, equivalence called Association of Indian Universities. If that happens, that's great. The second criteria, of course, is you should have a GRE or GMAT score. The uh, requirement is 300 for GRE and 600 score minimum for GMAT and uh, you know within the last five years. And finally, the final merit list will be created on the basis of composite score and personal interview. Again, because composite score is not given or whatever is not given, so we can't really say anything about it. But because composite score will definitely have CAT component to it, we can say that the better your CAT has been, the more are the chances for you to convert this one. And of course, personal interview would also be considered significant. It's just that I'm expecting that CAT would have slightly higher percentage, but I might be wrong. But the important thing is that, you know, these would be the two criterion. These are the important dates. You can check that out. And finally, you know, if you are eligible for that, fill it and keep checking your email.